pretty standard here. The Spire into five hat Hydra. Oh, she is actually getting a Carapace upgrade, so maybe this is going to be Muta. Sometimes you'll kind of sit and not... Yeah, right? Because we don't even see the Hydra list in as of yet. So it looks like it's just going to be ample a lot of the times. Stims, because Stim ups your movement speed, so he'll get there before. And if you're there at all before, you will crush base. Now, if you look at the build that he used here against Cadenzi, it was an 8 racks where he never even attacked. He focused on killing the Overlord, and then he followed this up with one of his really patented uh, stim rushes, where he is walking across the map and then stimming the second you see him. So he eliminated the overlord that sees him move out and then use this type of play that he loves to use. So this was pure ample, and you can really see this is a that eight racks that we were originally a little bit confused about was perfectly planned out, right? And look at this, the mutas are, okay, put some in each. See? And now it's two bunkers you have to kill with your lings. Brutal. And now Vulture's out, and you've forced into making all these slow Zerglings. Yeah, we're going to make a new account, because... There's fucking win streaks. So as soon as you get cheesed out in a stupid fucking match like that, it ruins everything. And you spend forever low. Forever. No, he didn't do a good Ling run by, you fucking moron. That was the stupidest thing I've ever seen, that Ling run by. The stupidest. God, he was bad. Oh my God. Fucking moron wasting my time. Oh my god. Oh my god, he's so bad. He's like, well, I see a bunker there and a marine wall and a depot. You know what I'm gonna do? It's like, dude, what if I have any reaction speed to that? What happens to you then? It's like, oh, well, I mean, I lose the game because uh, I keep making lings when I shouldn't be. Fucking idiot. Guys, there's wind streaking, so it's actually, it's a big issue if you lose a fucking match like that. Because then I'm going to play C players for the rest of the time here and climb up way slower. It's a waste of time. It's actually quicker to make the count again. I will actually climb quicker because of this. Fucking idiot. Cartosis is not about the theory. Fucking idiots. Fucking chat scientists. I think they're so goddamn smart. Literally no idea. Literally no idea. You caught up in the theory, Cartosis. What I'm pissed about is he wasted my time. I play that guy 10 times, I beat him nine times, okay? But now he's wasted my time. He's wasting his own time too, by doing stupid fucking moves. That guy's never gonna raise out to S. You think that guy's ever gonna fucking improve? No! Fucking idiots. <laughs> Go in the trap. Yeah, bye. Moron. SCP good to go, sir. These fucking people come in here. They have no messages. Like, oh, he lost the other guy. One, I know, right? Guy in the chat. All that matters is who wins at a moment. Chris Moneymaker is still the best poker player on earth. Still the best one. Because he won that, that tournament. Also, I saw the other day someone beat Dan Negreanu in a hand, and I was like, 
We have a new goat. Sick. This is all that matters. One poker hand, one game. That's all that matters, guys. That one fucking thing. What's your MMR at right now? How are you talking about chat? Chat! Why are you so stupid, chat? Fuck. What am I doing with my life? Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> what is he even doing? Oh my god. It's like the stupidest worst thing you can do. What the fuck? Like, are you serious? My Marines are just sitting there in my main and you're gonna... What are we doing? A puddle, because it's like everything he's doing is stupid. Ah! He has no idea what he's doing! He has no idea! Like, my Marines are sitting in my main base and his mutas are microing against them. What? What? Like, you don't even understand in theory what you're supposed to do, let alone have good micro. And then, when he morphs his lurkers, he morphs the one on the ramp first. Like, what? I got to kill him because of that. Because he literally doesn't even know what order to, lur to fucking make his lurkers in. That's not a real game. Holy shit. I can't play against people like this. I got nothing nice to say. Marines were sitting in the main base and he started to harass my Marines. Like, I actually lost some extra ones because I was just like, what? Okay, you're supposed to fly the mutas around and find areas that the Marines are not in. When I have a group of Marines plus three medics standing there, your mutas aren't going to do anything. I'm going to kill mutas. You're not going to get any damage on. This is what I want. I want to damage your mutas because the more damage they are, the easier it is for me to move out, right? So either don't bring them in or bring them in somewhere else. That's the first Second thing, he took an engagement, he couldn't win. Did you notice when the Muta Ling, when my two groups of Marines and Medics were moving across the map, the Muta Ling attacked in and I just stimmed and went back in macro? Do you remember that part? That was because I just looked at his army and I knew that it would die. <laughs> Cause he can't, it's like I'm sitting here with plus one range stim, something like 20 Marines and four or five Medics in there. 100% he can't stop that with that little crappy force he had. So he, he fought that, that was another thing he did completely wrong. And then when he was morphed, he, he morphed them in the only order that made sure that he died. <laughs> and the thing is, he might have even lived if he hadn't thrown away his mutaling and he used his mutas against the Marines in my main, so all their hit points were gone. Like, when you put it all together, it's like, you really lined this up to be as quick as possible for me. Thank you so much. But at the same time, I'd rather not play that game. playing someone that bad we can't do it we can't use energy this is why i've lived my family line has gotten to me trillions of years of evolution <laughs> because we conserve energy when we don't need to use it in our ladder games against fucking <laughs> fucking bimbos right the people who didn't survive Are you fucking kidding me? How many times do I have to tell shit to build? I told that demon to build four fucking times! And now I have a massive supply block. Fucking stupid. Game in the fucking world. Takes the most skill. These Terrans knocking on the door of A stand no fucking chance my against my one double proxy gate a day. No fucking chance. Not even close. Was that even close? That wasn't even close. I am undefeated against Terran. But you're afraid now, Scarlet. Shaking in your boots. 
somehow I managed to beat no observer man who didn't only go into DTs right away, but did not go into Arbiter. DTs, walk goons through mines. Third base. No vision on the map. Zero vision on the map. Probably his minimap didn't show his own fucking base. And then he went into carriers. Disgusting. Disgusting. Oh, she hasn't streamed her, her game, so I haven't been able to do any homework, basically. So I'm not exactly sure, but I think we're probably a pretty good match. I assume that... Like, I don't, I don't know what your MMR is right now, but I assume it's, like, within the range that I can fight against. Can, can we get both of you guys to confirm where your MMR is? Not, not 